Good morning, welcome to the Tate Farm Greenhouse. It's a hot July morning, but we are up here early, and today we wanna to share um, the notion of succession gardening, and particularly for fall crops. And even though it's hard to imagine that it's time to start planting for fall, it is. And there's several categories of plants that um, you might wanna consider. One would be the things that are heading, like broccoli, cauliflower, and cabbages. Those want to get planted now as plants, and um, you can plant them for about two more weeks into the last week of July, and then you can expect a lovely harvest of um, those crops coming in in late September and October. The next category of um, fall plants and garden vegetables would be the leafy greens, and this would include the kales, collards, chard, um, broccoli rob, and uh, some things that are considered hardy. And those can be planted now into about the first or second week of August. And then you can enjoy harvest from that all, even all the way up until Thanksgiving, assuming we don't have a really, really cold snap. Then we can also think about putting in lettuces. These are uh, summer heat tolerant varieties and um, they're great but then coming soon we'll have more um, sort of third season or fall varieties that aren't quite as as dense in their leaf structure so there's still a whole lot of gardening to be done and if you get your plants in in the next few weeks you can enjoy beautiful abundant harvests in late September October and even into November now the other thing you might want to consider is some direct seeding and so if you want root crops like carrots and beets and radishes and you could add turnips to that list you'll want to consider putting those in in the next few weeks as well before the uh, end of july you'll want to be direct seeding these crops into the ground and you'll be able to enjoy a beautiful um, beautiful roots come late fall the other thing you could consider is direct seeding some hardy greens, which includes spinach, chard, and kale. You can either put them in as plants, or in the next couple weeks, you could put them in as seed into your garden as well. And then there are the quicker growing greens, like arugula and lettuce mixes, that you can be direct seeding now and probably get a couple more direct seedings in that you'll be able to enjoy um, tender little greens for the next few months as well. So we hope you'll consider fall gardening and trying a succession planting of your next crops for your garden. Have a great day.